in Shaban. The shilling has weakened further to trade at a new low of 160 units to the U.S. dollar. Now, this comes just six weeks after the Central Bank of Kenya raised its benchmark interest rate from 10.5% to 12.5% to arrest the slide of the currency. Now, let's take a look, uh, take a quick look actually, are the trends between the U.S. dollar and the Kenyan shilling. Now, looking at the graph and going five years back between January 2019 and September 2022, the shilling lost ground against the dollar by only 20 units to stand at 120 shillings. In contrast, the local currency subsequently depreciated at a much faster rate in just 17 months to trade at the current level, falling by an additional 40 units. The fast pace of weakening started in the second half of 2022 when the country held its general election and the steepest decline was seen last year with the shilling weakening by 20 units in seven months to the current level from 140 shillings at the start of July 2023. The depreciation of the shilling has been attributed to multiple factors, including the flight of foreign capital, rising interest rates in developed economies and global economic shocks brought by the Russia-Ukraine war. The National Treasury, on its part, earlier said that the local currency had been overvalued and was not now settling at its true value. The question on everyone's mind is how low can the shilling